I want to talk to you today about four words. Just four words. Those four words are a well-regulated militia. Any of you who know the Constitution know probably what that is. And the full text of the Second Amendment is a well-regulated militia being necessary to the security of a free state, the right of the people to keep and bear arms shall not be infringed. A lot of constitutional scholars agree that the purpose of the Second Amendment was to prevent the United States from ever needing a formal national military to defend itself. The Founding Fathers envisioned well-regulated militias of citizens would form the defense of the United States of America. What they did not intend, according to many constitutional scholars, was that every citizen, just for the sake of fetishize, fetishizing, whatever, would own their own gun. That was not the purpose of the Second Amendment. Nowhere in the Constitution, in the Second Amendment, does it say citizens shall bear arms to protect themselves and their families. Nowhere does it say citizens shall bear arms because it's my God-given right. That's not what it says. The Second Amendment was meant that citizens could bear arms as members of a well regulated militia to defend the United States, period. So how did we get here a couple hundred years later where all the Second Amendment advocates and the gun rights advocates and the lobbyists and the NRA completely ignore and deny the four words that matter the most in the amendment? A well-regulated militia. Well-regulated means there are rules, there are limitations, there are laws, there are, is structure, there is training. Well-regulated. And now we have been, a large part of our community, of our society, has been brainwashed to believe that any regulation is a, an infringement upon their rights. When the word regulated is in the Second Amendment, it's right there, read it. So how did we get to a place where those who are big Second Amendment advocates believe that any regulation at all is a, an infringement on that right? It doesn't make sense. That is not true. It is inaccurate. It is brainwashing. It is fear-mongering. We need more good people with guns to counteract the bad people with guns. It's a slippery slope. You start regulating guns and, you you know, that's the first part of a fascist state. They take away your guns. No one is taking them away. But we need them to be well regulated. The first three words of the Second Amendment, a well regulated those are the first three words, and nobody wants to acknowledge that. Nobody wants to recognize that. Enough is enough. I was just reading comments from viewers from around the world, and they're shaking their heads. There is something broken. There is something wrong with us. That we defend the right to carry a thing, a thing, a thing whose sole purpose is to maim and kill and injure. That we defend this over the lives that it takes. All in the name of some imaginary slippery slope, all in the name of some imaginary threat. Every country, developed country, industrialized country on the planet has mental illness. We are the only country that allows our children to continue to be victims of this thing. 
this thing that means more than life. We are the anomaly of the world and people just don't understand why we don't do something. We are the only country in the world that lets just about anybody and everybody get a weapon with minimal checks, background checks, mental checks, no insurance, cars you even have to have insurance or training. We're the only country in the world. And if your fear that taking away your gun is going to cause the government to control you, Look at the other countries who, who have implemented gun laws. They're safer. Kids aren't getting murdered. Gun violence. There isn't the even close to the amount of gun violence that we have. And they are free and fair societies. Their government isn't overreaching. They're not taking away other rights. They're protecting their people. That's what a government is supposed to do. It's supposed to protect their people. Not a thing. Enough is enough. A well-regulated militia. Regulated. Regulated. How many times can I say regulation is in the very verbiage of the freaking amendment? And yet, people just scream about any regulation. Please wake up. Is this who we want to be? That we want to value a thing over the lives of children? It's heartbreaking, it's heart-wrenching, and it's flabbergasting to still see the day after 18 children were gunned down, people defending a thing. That's how I see it. Leave your thoughts below. Thanks for being here.